Assalamu alaikum and good morning again to all of my students and whoever is in front of the screen right now watching this video. I hope you're all in great health and feeling good about a new day today. So this is our literacy class and we are learning many numbers these days. We are practicing tracing all the numbers we have learned how to write the numbers, right? So we are just going to have a quick look at what we did, like one, we did two, and then uh, we did, we have number three, and number four, one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight and nine right okay we called all the numbers so we did from one to nine we even traced so today i need mean, to do another number right so uh, let's see uh, first of all you're going to tell me that uh, how many markers are in my hand okay so you're going to count how many markers are in my hand. Now let's count all of them. Uh, they are one, two, three, four, five, six. How many markers do I have right now? There are six markers in my hand, right? Can you see? There are six markers in my hand. Okay, now you're going to tell me how many markers are in my hand? Is there any? No, there's no marker in my hand. So how do we say that? How many markers do I have? No markers, yes. And we say it zero, right? <laughs> we say it zero, right? So we are going to do today zero and zero is our hero yes zero is our hero because when we put it with some other numbers they big 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 numbers yes so today we are going to do zero okay we are going to today going to do today zero which is our hero so we are introducing number zero today. Okay, now I'm going to show you a picture in which we uh, uh, just have a look at the quantity, how we're going to see zero, okay? So I'm going to share my screen with you. Okay, now can you see this? I'm just going to uh, enlarge it a little. Okay, now have a look at this. Now you can see two jars over here, right? Can you see two jars over here? Yeah, there are two jars. Now look at the jar at your left. Now count the cookies inside the jar. Now count the cookies. One, two, three, four, five, six. There are six cookies in the jar, right? Now, have a look at the jar at your right hand side. Now, how many cookies are in that jar? Yeah, that is empty. There are no cookies in the jar. So what we're going to say, how many cookies are in the jar? Zero, yes. How many cookies are in the jar? Zero cookies. Yes, very good. Okay, now let's have a look at the other picture. Okay, now count the trees at the left. One, two, three, four, five, six. And on the right hand side, there's only one. So there is no zero over here. Okay, now have a look at this. Now we have two plates over here. Yay. One plate have 
slices of pizza. How many slices of pizza are on the left hand side of the plate? Yes, there are five pieces. Yeah, that's great. How many are there? Yeah, there are five pieces of pizza on the plate, which is on your left hand side. Yeah, very good. Okay, now look at the right hand side of the plate. Oh, maybe you ate all the pizzas. Now, how many pizza slices? Zero. There are zero pizzas in the plate on the right hand side. Okay, that is great. Yes. Oh, now look at the right hand side of the ice cream. How many scoops are there on the cone? One, two, three, and four. Yes, there are four scoops at the right hand side of the cone. Oh my God. And then what happens on the left hand side of the cone? Oh, uh, they all got melted. And now how many scoops do you see at the left hand side? No scoop. So zero. There are zero scoops on the cone. Oh, that's not good. Now you dropped it and maybe it got melted because it's getting hot these days. So the ice cream got melted. Okay, now we are going to have a look at the other picture now. Yay, okay, now you're going to look at this picture and we are going to see which has got zero. Okay, now have a look at this. Now there are two trees in front of you, right? So yeah, we are going to count the tree at the right hand side, how many apples are there? Now you're going to count one, two, three, four, five apples. Okay, now on the other hand, the left hand side, you're going to count. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, now if we put zero with one, that makes ten. See? The zero has no value, but when we put it with one, this makes 10, very good. Now we have 10 apples, yes, on the left-hand side of the tree. So this is one and this is zero, right? One and zero. And when we have joined them together, they make 10, yay, that's great, okay. So have a look at this. Oh yes, now look at the right hand side of the apple. How many apples do you see over here? Just one. Now we're going to put that back. And how many do you see on the left hand side? That is zero. Yes, now we are go not going to put one with it because this is only zero. We have zero apples over here. So we are going to say that it has no apples on the tree. There are zero apples on the tree. But if we look at this tree, the one which is in front of us, only this tree, if you look at this, the, uh, the tree on the left, it does not have zero. It does not have one. But all together, it has 10 apples, right? The tree at the left hand side, it has got 10 apples, okay? Now, I hope you got that. Okay, now there are two, two trees again. Now look at the left hand side and we're going to count the apples. How many apples do you see at the left hand side of the tree? One, two, three apples. Yes, there are three apples. And how many do you see at the right hand side? No apples, so that means there are zero apples on the tree, right? There are zero apples on the tree. That's great. So you got the concept that there are only 
zero apples on the tree. And if you put zero with one, that makes, yeah, I'll show you again. When we put zero and one, that makes 10. And if you're going to put more zero, another zero, that was going to even make it hundred and thousands. So he, zero is our hero. Yes. Okay, that's great. So I am going to uh, show you a video that is going to tell you a little more about zero, okay? Let's watch the video. Hello, look what we have here. We have two zeros, but even two zeros are equal to a zero. So it's nothing. Like we have one person there sitting on the table, but the other table is empty. Zero person there. Oops. Now we have no one there. Zero. Oh, we have one sofa in the room. Hmm, that's one sofa. And now we have no sofas, so it's zero. No value. Nothing, no substance. Okay, that's great. See, zero alone has no value, but when it comes and join another uh, number, that becomes a hero, right? So uh, this was uh, the concept of zero. So you have to look around where you can see zero things. And how do you see zero and observe around like it's zero? Uh, the, it, when it was autumn, how many leaves do you see on the trees? Yeah, zero trees on the leaves. But now it's spring, so it's, the leaves are coming. So now they're again filled with the leaves. So what if the car has zero tires? Will you be able to drive that car? No, we won't be able to drive the car with zero wheels. We will not be able to drive even the car with three wheels. How many wheels do you need to drive the car? How many? Yay, we need four wheels. Yes, that's great. So zero is nothing, but when it joins with the other numbers, that makes it hero. And this was today's concept, zero, okay? So uh, I'm going to say goodbye from this class now and I'll see you in the next class soon, inshallah. Till then, please subscribe my channel, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And don't forget to wash your hands frequently. Please wash them and don't get, get out of your home unnecessarily. And if you're going out, please keep the, maintain the social distancing and don't forget to put on your mask, please please, please, right? It's very, very important. Be responsible to be safe yourself and to keep others safe, right? So be a responsible person. Every single person who is watching, whether you're a child, whether you're grown up, whether you're an adult, whoever you are, please take care of yourselves and take care of others as well, okay? So I'll see you soon. Till then, stay safe, be happy, and please be grateful. So till the next lecture. Bye-bye and Allah Hafiz.